Hi guys, so it's Abby and welcome back to my channel. Today we have a very special episode because I have a very special guest as you guys can see. Yo, <laughs> all right. All right, none other than Youngblood. Hello. We are at the AMAs right now. We're sitting down to get red carpet ready. I'm going to be doing Dom's makeup. <laughs> Make sure you stay tuned, subscribe and stick, stick. Make sure you stay tuned, subscribe, and hit the notification bell below. <laughs> All right, guys, we're in Camden right now at the Roundhouse, which is where they're filming the EMAs today. Dom's just in here doing his performance right now, so let's go on in. This looks insane. Look at the set that they've got going on, and Dom's just getting strapped up to his wires right now. I think he's going to be flying. <laughs> Uh, come on, BBC News. <laughs> okay, so we just caught the end of Dom doing cotton candy. Now they're just setting up to do strawberry lipstick. Mum, I'm buzzing for this. <laughs> Me too. Are you excited? I'm so excited. <laughs> we have a really exciting look planned today, don't we? We do. As soon as I met Abs, I was like, what? You are like a genius. <laughs> I wanted to do a leopard print straight jacket and matching outfit and have like the print bleed on my face. Leopard boy, aye, aye, aye. <laughs> it's been a very long day for you on set, on all these wires, all this crazy stuff. How did you find it? I was like, I, I, I think this is like a bad time to say I'm afraid of heights. <laughs> <laughs> I absolutely hate heights. Well, it was sick. If I could tell like my 12 year old self that I'd be doing that, like I'd have a guitar and like have a Union Jack pants on, like rock and roll. Bro, oh. it was mad. Me and my guitar player were looking at each other like... <laughs> I was just watching from the sidelines and I'm like, I'm just tired looking at you, so you must Bro, be exhausted. Bro, I'm just like... <laughs> it was almost like... Unreasonable. I want to be an angel. I want like a bike ball that like fires stuff from it and I want to fly and then I'm gonna like smash the camera. And everyone just kind of went, yeah, all right. <laughs> but everyone's legends, man. How did this opportunity like even come about for the Bro, I don't know. Area? I remember like at one point I told my fan base in New York to meet me in Times Square outside the MTV building. Mm -hmm. So I think they said to me ever since then they kind of wanted to see what I'd do if, if they let me perform. So. Mm -hmm. I was looking at like the list of who's performing and stuff and there's like a really short list of people who's actually doing these huge performances. Bro, it's so, crazy. Like I can't big. wait. I just thought it was being a bit of punk to it, do you know what I mean? A bit of punk to the glitz and the glam. Then you've still got your eyeliner on from earlier as well. Always, man. Probably, <laughs> on, probably still on from last night. Your hair's still purple, though. I, know, I think I might keep it for a bit, though. You yeah, should keep it. Fun. I'm into it. I was going to go purple. Yeah. I was going to copy you. <laughs> I was. match it. You've had quite a few hair colours now yourself. So Prove cool. I have. I was wondering what to go next. I don't know. Did you have a good Halloween? It was insane. I've been so freaking Bruh, busy. Yeah, I know, I can imagine. I bet everyone's hitting you up being like, yo, I'm absolutely doing my makeup. Mm -hmm. Well, this is my favourite TikToker. Out. You're one of them as well. Yeah, I'm one of them. <laughs> I don't know if you guys saw, but like we did a bunch of TikToks and stuff together, which blew up. Everyone loved them. Bro, I loved so it. Much. Dude, I didn't know you were from Leeds, because like we're from like 20 minutes from yeah. where each of us are from. <laughs> and I was like, what? She's a northerner. <laughs> I've got a proper ticklish nose. <laughs> 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 How was your Halloween though? You did, did like quite a few looks yourself. I was looking on Instagram. Did you? Yeah. Did you have a little stalk? Did you? <laughs> Tim Burton's like my favourite. You should see my house. Isn't it all like Tim like, Burton? Dude, I got skulls everywhere and oh, it's like dark I love that. I love and that. black. Uh, you haven't seen my red carpet outfit just yet, but it's like skulls and. Is it? Because I didn't have a red carpet outfit like prepared whatsoever. <laughs> dude, and I was like, and oh yeah, like, I'll be a carpet then. By the way, you can come on the red carpet if you want. And I was like, okay. I like didn't have anything, so I had to like paint. Some trousers. You painted your I like painted it myself. I That's have, like, cooler. Designs. That's cooler. It's really cool. How did you get into like songwriting and stuff? I always wrote tunes. I just figured out I was like a really bad guitar player, so I was like, I better start writing songs because that'll like save my life, maybe. <laughs> I told you last time we hung out that I'm like just getting into it myself. I haven't spoken about this. Online, Dude, the yeah, songs are good, I've heard them. Spoiler <laughs> alert. Spoiler alert. I write songs about like being who you are and politics and that. Mm -hmm. And then um, everyone else was like, write tunes about like, I love you so much, I'm gonna myself. I believed it. So just like, always try and tell the truth from your songs. I mean, that's when it started yeah. kind of getting any kind of successful. And never be afraid to tell the truth. I love that about your music though. I feel like it really connects with a lot of your fans and you're like, 
definitely really passionate about connecting with your audience and having a relationship with them. But they're well. the best, man. I love them. They're proper cute. They're so passionate. It's great. Everybody watching this, spam, spam the comments with black hearts, man. <laughs> Show me BHC. I bet you can't wait to like get back touring and stuff. Bro, after today, all like, this. I've cut all my hands open, and that sounds like dark and weird, but when I hit the guitar and like cut my hands open and bleed, I feel like I'm on tour again, which is sick. Yeah, I'm like feeling that. like you're back on stage. Bro, I missed it today. I was like, what? But you just uh, announced your. New tour, I just right? announced my new tour. Oh, cheers for the plug. <laughs> plug. Yeah, man, we just announced it. Some places are already selling out, and these like big venues now. We're like, what? Yeah. I saw you crashed Ticketmaster. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's like, Ticketmaster's not working. I'm like, no, it's our end. And I call my agent, he's like, yeah, no, there's just 200 people <laughs> on the site. You just moved back from LA. How long ago did you get back? Yeah. Literally like two months ago. It was cool, man. I like the sunshine, but I miss home. Yeah. I like. Chocolate obnobs <laughs> and fish and chips and yeah. cups of tea. People well, don't get me over there. Everyone's just like, who is this idiot? I have to put on an American accent if I'm like asking for something because they don't Do understand you? it. Yeah, Do I'll it. Do Starbucks. I'm like, can I get a water? Oh my god! Bro, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, I just like got, I just want to go like chill out later. Do you know what I mean? Like, it's hard. Dude, like, we should go to like the beach yeah. and like eat some like cotton candy and then. <laughs> I'm by the power of editing. Hey, new song. Wow. Wow. We're on to the neck now. We're on to the old neck. Neck ski boo. Yeah, the outfit is so sick. How did you come up with the, the idea that you like? Basically, one of my like best friends in the whole universe. Her name is Jessie Jo Stark. She's like literally like vi this generation's Vivian Westwood. She's just a genius. And then Kat over there and Drew. They're the best, man. And the first album called The 21st Century Liability is me in a straight jacket. So like, how can we kind of develop that and make it a bit more rock and roll yeah. style? Cotton, cotton candy. candy just dropped. See, well. see, cotton candy did just drop. Yeah. How's dude, it going with that? Dude, with it is crazy. It blew been... up, man. I was like, what is going on? It's been crazy on TikTok. I've seen so many people. Bro, so many people use it on TikTok. I'm like, man. How are you finding like TikTok and stuff? Because you've only recently just got. Bro, into, like, I kind of like it. I think it's like punk as fuck. People expressing themselves and being who they are, there's nothing more punk than that, do you know what I mean? Who's some of your favourite people to watch on TikTok? I love you. Aww. Bro, I literally seen that Johnny Seahawk. He's from Leeds as well. Bro, he's literally not, but he lives in Leeds. And I was oh. like, what is going on, bro? Like when I was first joining TikTok, which was just like January last year. Dude, how did how have you got 13.4 million for our oh, 13.4 today, actually, everybody. Just hey. Celebration. Thank you, <laughs> How'd you get that so quick? Honestly, it just I think TikTok is just completely different to every other social media app in that you can just blow up literally overnight. Dude, you just went mad. Oh, this is sick. <laughs> I'm literally a tiger right now. I had a couple of videos go really viral last year with like Halloween especially was, like popping off and everyone just loved it. So I just went, I went from like having no followers on there to like a couple million within a month. Dude, that's mental. Oh, I can't scratch me neck. You want to see it? No. Oh no 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 no. Oh no 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 no. Uh, you've had like a lot of crazy looks that you've worn on like red carpets and music videos and stuff. What do you think's been like the favourite? Probably <laughs> Clueless at the Anime Awards. That was sick. Yeah. So the red carpet outfit, the sweater that I'm wearing, like I designed and we're going to be releasing it as like a limited edition for Christmas as well. Christmas plug, make so sure you, you get guys, it. If you guys want to wear my red carpet outfit, then you can. <laughs> Alright guys, so we're going to go ahead and finish this section off camera and then we'll be back to show you guys the final reveal. Guys, this is the final look. How do you like it? Bro, I love it, man. It's it mental. So I look crazy. This outfit is insane. Put me in a straight well. jacket. Because <laughs> I am move. insane right now. <laughs> if you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up, smash that subscribe button, and the notification bell so you don't miss a new video every time we upload. If you wanna stay tuned with me on all my other socials, you can follow me on Instagram at Abby Roberts and Abby R Artistry on everything else. And if you wanna follow Dom. 
At Youngblood, Y-U-N-G-B-L-U-D. Album's coming out December 4th. Love you all. Be safe, be weird, and just be mental. Yeah. And stream cotton candy. Oh, cheers, Abs. <laughs> <You're all right. laughs> Once again, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.